put together this little video to show you um, how easy and fun it is to make some um, hand carved stamps and then you can stamp onto like index cards or Bristol paper or watercolor paper and then you can kind of cut up that abstract stuff that you that you stamp and then you can use it in your art journal so if you see the bottom right corner there you can see the little green um, stamp that I carved all right so it's really 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 super easy here I have a black jelly roll um, I have a uh, Pentel white uh, eraser these guys carve like butter there it's so easy it doesn't take any um, strength um, in your hands unlike the other uh, carving block up above that takes a lot more hand strength so I have a lino cutting tool this is one with sort of like a rounded V bottom I don't really know the exact name for these tools but this one has a very narrow um, channel at the bottom uh, you get them in a whole pack so it's like they're speedball lino cutting nibs and then a whole bunch come uh, in the same pack so that way you can just play around anyway so then you just sort of push down to carve out your little channels I guess you could say and um, just remember that whatever you carve whatever your wherever your carving tool goes that's what will not print so you're carving out the negative space and so that's going to be a really important key when you design your stamps So there's a lot of fun options for this little wavy thing I did. Obviously you can just make a regular wavy line with this, but then I also was playing, and since I put a point on one end, I can um, I can just make that repeat. And then I also, um, later I'll show you a journal page where I made like a little mandala with that. Okay, so these are all these nibs that come in the, the package. And then there's a little holder thing you stick, I don't, Think they're even called nibs but anyway put that in there and da 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 and then you're ready to roll okay so now let's carve um some like a lino lino cutting material i don't really like this material all that much so i'm not gonna recommend it it's kind of hard to carve um, but this is uh this is all i have on hand so i'm gonna just show you i'm gonna draw an og which is one of my favorite patterns and one of the really nice things about um, stamp carving is you can just correct what you're doing as you go so you're only going to cut out what you want to cut so if you see you know some sort of uh, problem with your lines or whatever you can just go back over them um, so I'm going to make this OG and I'm going to then carve it out and I'm not quite sure I haven't decided how I'm going to do that yet but anyway I'm going to use these speedball cutting tools and um, you know you can just watch as I as I go so anyway try something I'll uh, just try to make any kind of uh, repeating pattern or a little um, tiny image or something all right so have fun with this one the rest is just going to be music as you watch me uh, carve this one and I'll show you some examples of how you might um, use this stamp to um, make some impressions all right have fun <laughs> <laughs> 